There was once an amazing man called Heracles. He was the strongest man in Crete. One day he got news from the king of Crete to come to his castle on the hilltop. Absolutely delighted by his letter, Heracles started the long sleep walk up Mount Crete. Clambering frantically to the top of Mount Crete, Heracles mumbled under his breath, Almost there! Just a few more steps! Yes! I'm finally at the top! Crash! Suddenly, without warning, the huge brown gates opened, and there proudly stood the king of Mount Crete. Grandly, the king stated, I have been waiting for you, my warrior. Come inside and I will tell you what to do. The king led Hercules to the window that had a view over the ocean, so Hercules could see the bloodthirsty monster, Zartor. Don't worry, I shall return, Hercules said with great confidence in his voice. Seconds later, the ship left the dock with Hercules on the sailing boat. It sped faster and faster and faster by the minute. Soon, it was black speck floating on the horizon. Boomed a voice. Suddenly, the bubbles surrounded the boat. Then, a strange looking man popped out of the water. Heracles knew that face. It was the sea god, Poseidon. I'm guessing you are Heracles, young man. Yes, and I'm travelling to where the monster Zato dwells. I shall stay the so close cool beast, announced Heracles. Then you will need these. Poseidon presented Heracles with an underwater sword and a pump full of ants blood. The ants blood is our dog's weakness, said Poseidon. Oh, one more thing. I shall grant you the power to be underwater. Thank you, shouted Shout. Heracles as he sped away. Later on, Heracles reached the spot where Zartog was and dived into the water. Heracles reached the seabed and suddenly the terrible beast sprang out of the seabed. Who goes there? Hiss Zartog. Then Zartog swung his tail at Heracles, sending Heracles flying down to the seabed. Heracles was furious. Then, with one strike of his sword, he chopped off Zartog's tail. How dare you! shouted Zartog. Suddenly, Heracles remembered the blood! Oh, quickly he pumped the ant's blood into Zartog's tail. Slowly, Zartog fell to the seabed. Then, And something caught Heracles' eyes. Heracles swam closer to inspect it. And when he was close enough, he saw the whole lump of gold in and a box of treasure and jewelry. Holy sardine! shouted Heracles. Seconds later, Heracles had all the treasure loaded onto his boat and he sailed back to Crete where the king was waiting. Thank you.